There's a drive coming from the Waratahs, trapped at the back. And the penalty will go to New South Wales. They take it quickly. Barker to Fredrickson, running straight through a hole is Arabella McKenzie, and she is over. Oh, talk about hit the gap. Played fly half in the opening round. There's no Mahalia Murphy this week, so she's dropped back to the 15 jersey to fullback. And the flyer from the East Club in Sydney scores the first five-pointer. What a try. There's a penalty from the scrum. Lane Morgan taking it quickly through the hands and straight through the gap goes Arabella McKenzie. It's her 10th game for New South Wales, and that's what they've got right across the park, experience in key positions. Crucial have that experience in those key positions, those drivers, or as the rugby league like to talk about, that spine of your team. They get another opportunity here. So Lane Morgan puts it in. Advantage. And Hamilton having a run from the base. She's big, she's strong, she's over. No try. No. Whoa. Well, the referee's saying I no try. My, my decision is no try, unless you've seen a grand feed round held up. Yep. It's no try, it's been held up. So we'll go back for the penalty. Wow, terrific defence again from the uh, the Brumbies, but they take the tap quickly, and they caught the mapping. Over she goes, Lane Morgan. She's got the try. And the Brumbies were just... Trying to reset their line, and Morgan like a thief in the night. The quick tap, and over she goes. Nobody in front of her. Yeah, so we'll replay the penalty because I didn't call time back on, and that's what's on me. Sorry about that. Strum? Yeah, okay. No try. Wow. What decision has, uh, has been made to uh, award a scrum? So another opportunity for the Waratahs and Hamilton releases it now for Morgan. She gives it to Pili. It's gone backwards and out to Vella. Morgan to Hamilton. They keep working to the short side. And McKenzie, she has got a double. Arabella McKenzie. Sustained pressure inside the uh, Brumbies red zone and the Waratahs denied a little earlier on but now McKenzie spotted the gap and it was straight through, 12 mil. Another look at it here. Good carry from Hamilton. Quick recycle. Plenty of Brumbies defenders there but they're all heading towards Mayor Stewart on the right wing. McKenzie said thank you. I'll we still have that advantage. Still advantage for the Waratahs. Robinson takes the direct route. Morgan Pillai. And they look to get it wide. McKenzie throws the dummy. She's got a double already. Here's Stewart. Stewart got on the outside. Maya Stewart. Away she goes. They get chased, but nobody's going to stop the flyer. That is five tries in this tournament for Maya Stewart. In fact, it's now 17 tries in 11 games for New South Wales. And let me tell you that that is the best strike rate in the professional era for either a Waratah male or a Waratah female. Uh, Maya Stewart, well done. Yeah, the best strike rate in the Super Rugby era. But uh, she's very modest after scoring four tries against the Reds in round one. She said she can only do it because her teammates give her the room to move. And she still had some work to do to get on the outside there. But she pins the ears back when she's in the clear. And Maya Stewart from the East Club in Sydney gets another one. And Super W. Hamilton to Badabasanga. Double round, Hamilton, Badabasanga, and now Stewart! Oh, every time she touches the ball, you can write down five points or so it seems. She's got a double, four tries in round one, two tries in round two so far.
Another look at it here. Yeah. How's my penalty count so far? This? It all went to plan on that occasion. Herrera had to come in, and that just gave that little bit of space out wide for Mayor Stewart to get on the outside. So here we go. Nagama driven back in the tackle. Five out. Pick and go by the Waratahs. Leotawa now. Oh, so close. They're claiming the try. Wait, wait. Just awarded as a front rower. Wait. I don't get to score too many unless you're Taniela Tupu. <laughs> okay, go there. Okay. No try. Knock on. Oh. Knock on. Knock on is the call, and that is full time. That's game, guys. In this final qualifying match, round three action in the Bill Corp Super W at Coffs Harbour. A win to the New South Wales Waratahs over the Brumbies, 24 points to three. And the New South Wales Waratahs still unbeaten in the history of Super W. It started in 2018. And we will see them again in the final on Saturday against the Queensland Reds. And gee, they've had some great battles over the years, the Reds and the Waratahs in Super W. We're expecting another cracker on Saturday as well.